today I want to talk about roommate etiquette. Um, I got very lucky in that my roommate gives me no problems, but I do have a few friends that actually have a lot of issues with their roommates, so I'm going to give you a few tips for you to avoid becoming one of those problematic roommates. Rule number one is respect your roommate's sleep time. If you have a morning class and they don't, don't just wake up and slam drawers and slam doors because it wakes them up and if you're not trying to be quiet then you're being loud so just try to be considerate and not make a lot of noise when you have to wake up before your roommate. Rule number two is respect your roommate's study time. If you see your roommate studying or doing homework, um, hold off conversations with them until after they're done and use headphones when you're listening to music because those things can be very distracting to someone that's trying to study. Rule number three is don't take your roommate's stuff if you don't ask to borrow them first. Rule number four is very simple, just don't put your stuff on your roommate's side. Rule number five is give your roommate your schedule so they know when they can have alone time because everyone wants some time to themselves. Rule number six is share responsibilities. Take turns taking out the trash, recycling, and sweeping the room. Rule number seven is listen to your roommate. If your roommate is telling you that they have a problem with something that you're doing, don't just completely ignore them. At least try to come up with a compromise to solve the problem. These are just a few tips on how you can become a better roommate. If you're actually having problems with your roommate, talk to them. Don't just keep it inside and expect them to know. If the problem still persists, speak to an RA, and if the problem still persists, then definitely think of a roommate change for the next semester. If you have any questions or concerns about college, feel free to contact me and I'll be happy to answer any questions you have for me.